Hello everyone, welcome back to another Pokemon stream, your first Pokemon stream, whatever it is. Hello, 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 welcome on in. And today, your host is Oliver. Happy Friday, everyone. Uh, stream is now taken over by one of my cats. <laughs> I've now transformed into Oliver. <laughs> Nitty, hello! How we doing? I'm here too, by the way. <laughs> I'm just gonna stand over here. Hello everyone, happy Friday. Oh, why didn't you tell us? You can't transform into a cat. I can't, this is Oliver. <laughs> Hi Savage. Happy Friday everyone. It's Friday! So, um, I guess I'm not allowed to sit today. Because this little dude took over. Just not gonna talk. <laughs> wait. Oh no, wait! There's actually- well, hold on. <laughs> that should be better. <laughs> Now, now you can fully appreciate the Oliver. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna just stand over here. I'm, I'm gonna be chat. I'm gonna be chat today, okay? Like, my shirt's black, so you can not see half of it. My arm's white, though, so you can see most of it. <laughs> so, um... Chat seems curvy today. Yeah, uh, you know that those things are called hips. I'm not sure if you've heard of them, but um, yeah, they're, they're hips. <laughs> so um, yeah, so Oliver's taking over stream. Uh, he is demonstrating to everyone how to take a bath, uh, how to be able to groom yourself properly. Uh, it involves a lot of dedication on his part. And uh, as you can see, he is definitely an expert in this grooming thing. So, uh, I am sitting on the wall right now. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. This is, uh, this is, uh, this is your tutorial, guys. Your tutorial to how to groom like a cat. <laughs> Hold on, I'm gonna get some water. Don't, don't, don't. So, uh, so yeah, I do not know how long my legs are going to be able to hold out in this position because I'm literally doing tension between the floor and the, <laughs> and the wall to keep myself in a sort of seating position is not great because I don't have muscles. So, um, so yeah, um, Oliver, when you're done giving everyone your tutorial, could you, um, could you let me sit down, <laughs> please? I, uh, I don't I don't think he's gonna let me. Will you let me sit down, please? Please? My legs can take a lot more. <laughs> no, my legs are done. My legs are over. Uh, sir, can I uh, can I get my chair back? You have a perfectly good tree over there. How to scratch your cat. Just scratchies. At least it's just one of them on the chair and not both of them. That helps. Hey, sir? I really, really could have some use of him having my chair back. Would that be okay? I don't want to beg you to let me sit down, but like I'm going to beg you to let me sit down. So could you like let me sit down? Because like I don't want to sit on your paws. So can you either go into loaf form? Can you transform into a loaf so I can sit down? Either that or get off the chair? I don't 
think begging is working. He's a baby. He gives kisses. He won't leave the chair, but he gives kisses. Well. We're just, I'm just gonna be a floating head over here. Uh, clearly he's uh, doing round two of uh, the demonstration of how to groom yourself. Um, <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay, so I'm gonna stick around over here because uh, this dude is not leaving anytime soon it seems. So I'm just gonna stick around over here until my knees hurt. So uh, it's gonna be uh, it's gonna be interesting. <laughs> Well then, uh, lovely people, so here's the plan for today. Shiny hunting. Our, uh, we have acquired a Herba Mystica dealer last stream, uh, called Huns. <laughs> and, um, our dearest Huns, uh, supplied us with a bunch of Herba Mystica. Like, just so many Herba Mystica. Like, we were thriving with the Herba Mystica. Speaking of devil, he shows up. Hans, welcome on in! Everyone say hello to our latest Herba Mystica supplier. Uh, it is Hans. Hans has an emote with a Christmas cap on. Guys, it's not even Halloween. Wait, do I need to push this further back so you can see his cute face sleeping? Yes, I do. There you go. Now you can see all of him. Now you can see all of Oliver. Um... <laughs> So, um, so yes, yeah, so Hans was very, very kind. Uh, he supplied us with a seven Herba Mystica raid that we were able to do multiple times because he kept resetting for us. So that was very kind of you. Thank you, Hans, again. I hope you enjoy your shiny love disc. <laughs> um, so that just means that we currently have like 44 Herba Mystica that we can use. That raid is sadly gone because of the new event. Oh, that's sad. That is sad. But I still have to thank you for supplying us with a buttload of Herba Mystica, which means that we can start shiny hunting again. And we're starting off with the shiny hunt. We're gonna get a Sentret. We're gonna evolve the Sentret into a Furret. And then we're gonna have the Furret walk because that is a necessity. Okay, the furret walk is a necessity. I have a furret walk dance. So, you have a buttload, you need to go to the toilet. Not that kind of buttload, Savage. Come on. <laughs> also, the hair is uh, kind of wild over on this side. What's, what's, uh, what's happening over here? There, that's better. MB Hockey! Hello! No age desi raids? The hair is herring, yeah, the hair is herring. What are H Desi? What what's H Desi? I'd be confused. He's confused too. He doesn't look like it. Oh, his Suyin raids. Uh no. I only care for raids for Herba Mystica, not really for anything else, so. Um so yeah, there's an event. Well, let's go see what the event is then, because I, I have no freaking clue. Let's uh, let's go let's go check this out. Oh, decidui, decidui is in is in the raids, is what you mean? Huh? Okay. Not my not my favorite form of decidui, I gotta say. I I think nobody using the real name. <laughs> Yeah, I don't, I don't like Hisuian Decidueye. I, I think original Decidueye is like a billion times better, but don't know how to spell it. D, D, E, C, S, E, D, U, D, U, and then I as in I. I think I just smudged my glasses. No. Somehow I didn't smudge my glasses. I thought I did, but I didn't. Haha! <laughs> Um, so, um, so let's go, let's go do this thing, shall we? So we can start shiny hunting as well, because I'm very excited for that. 
Let's have me shut up. Shut up, she shut up, shut up. Shut up, she shut up, shut up. Stop the talking, baby. Oh, we're starting off strong today. Let's go. Okay. Um, so Oliver's gonna remain seated. And, um, well, um, I, I guess I'm gonna stay in this corner. So let's see how this goes. Okay, let's go. Actually, pull Oliver a little closer. No, he can stay there. He can stay there. Actually, I'm gonna just. I'm just gonna. There, just like that. So I can be over here, and you guys can still see Oliver. Should I get a second chair? Do I have a second chair? I have a second chair. Give me a second. Let me get a second chair. Just hug the cat, he'll go away. You don't understand. This cat loves cuddles and hugs. I'll prove it. Hello, sir. So, uh, yeah, little dude absolutely loves cuddles, hugs, like immediately, the moment you look at him, he starts purring. That's how this works. <laughs> so, uh, so yeah. Uh, went to do some stuff today and had Limp Biscuit on the radio. Then hug him, pick him up, and put him on your lap. Okay, rule number one of cats. He sit. He comfy. I am not allowed to pick him up. Rule number two of cats. If he sit he comfy on your lap, you are not allowed to move. So, clearly he comfy. So, um, I just, I just have to leave him there because that would be against the law. <laughs> that would be the like that would be against the law of cats so I can't really do anything about this he has to leave of his own free will um, I mean I guess like if Bruno makes enough noise on the other room he might just like go check it out and then I'll get my chair back but apparently I have a second chair uh, so I think we're good for now we can just use this as a setup like he can stay in the background over here and I can just stay over here and I think this this can work yeah. <laughs> oh, if I do, if I, wait, if I do it like this, it's like I'm holding him. Not really, he's too big. <laughs> okay, let's go and see. We are here, but where do we need to be? Shut up, savage. Oh, we have a six star rate. Okay, we might as well go check this out while we're here. Hey! What's going on? And I say, hey, yeah, 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 hey, 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 yeah. I said, hey. What's going on? <laughs> Ooh, we got this dude over here. This did, did, did this dude give herbs last time? I don't think it did. Did it? I don't think it did. We'll just ignore it for now. Maybe we'll do one raid at the end of the stream, which will be this one. We just got started and two people are telling me to shut up. <laughs> oh no. Wait, there's a cave over there. I wanna check out that cave. Did I check out that cave before? I don't think I checked out that cave before. At least Nitty is cool and is allowed to. <gasps> I know I'm lame. You don't have to tell me that. Oh, this this cave is literally empty. Never mind. Savage, if I didn't like you, I wouldn't have said that. Yeah, I don't really tell people to shut up if I don't like them, so... Nitty does have a point there. If you like someone, you're not gonna tell them to shut up because, well... That's... Kinda... Rude. 
Okay, let's see here. We have one, two, three outbreaks on the map. That's it. We have three outbreaks on the map. Actually, let me just check the other map. Just to be sure that we don't have any, like, uh, EV outbreaks. We don't. We don't have any EV outbreaks. We're safe. We are safe for now. Uh, okay, so we're gonna go... I think it was over here where we saw a whole bunch of, um... Aw, my blobs were waiting for me. I think it was over here. I saw a whole bunch of, like, ev uh, ferrets. Not ferrets, uh, sentrets. Sentrets and ferrets and stuff like that. Yes! Yes, it was over here! Do you look darker or is that just a shade? No, that's just a shade. Pichu would be an interesting shiny hunt. Okay, so we're definitely good on location. Yeah, we're definitely good on location. I don't see any other normal types other than the uh other than the centrids, so this is where we'll be. Just curious, how's the sugar level today? I am actually not entirely sure. Um, I'm actually not sure. I had two half glasses of Coke, so that would be one full glass. Um, but I also had a buttload of chicken soup, and that that's like weighing down in my stomach. So, um, hey, did someone steal your chair? Uh, yeah, Moviator, this is Oliver. Um, he took my chair, but it, I have another chair in this room, so we can we can share the screen today. Oliver definitely wanted to be the the host today, so. <laughs> um, but yeah, so Savage, because I have like chicken soup weighing down in my stomach, I don't I don't know if if I don't know what the sugar levels are. What happened to the leaderboard? Uh, well, yes, uh, so, uh, Sien overtook, Sien overtook Sam, actually. Could you believe it? If Sam comes in here, he's no longer on the leaderboard. So, Sien be grinding. And Nitty is speed, yes, Nitty is very much speed. Yeah. Uh, Nitty, I think you're about halfway there for all the Pokemon that are in the game and will be in the game. Because I think we have... I have an Excel sheet that's nearly 1,400 lines. Each line is one Pokemon or Pokemon form, so... So, yeah. Uh, <laughs> you're doing great. Let's picnic. What do I need for normal types, actually? I need tofu. Do I have tofu? I know I'm picnicking, but like, do I have tofu? You're halfway there! About, just about, just about. Actually, this is really loud for some reason. Live an Oh, they're halfway there! Whoa! <laughs> Oh my gosh, you guys. Do I have tofu, though? That is the question. Ooh, I do have tofu. I am prepared somehow. Or maybe not. I only have one cucumber left. Oh my gosh. Let's get these Herbalisticas happening. Wait, which are the ones that I can't mix? I can't mix two sours. But I also can't mix a sour and a sweet, and I can't mix a sweet. So we're gonna use a sour and a bitter. And that should be fine. Uh, blue flag? Yeah, blue flag. I need to buy more flags. I promote my foster instant profile by liking pics of other animal related profiles, and I got timed out from likes. Uh, I believe so. I believe that is a thing that exists even though it's a little bit weird because like you can you can like a person's page Like you can like every single person Every single post a person has made if you're on their page and you won't get timed out 
but if you like multiple different pictures from multiple different pages, you will. I don't know what the threshold is, but it's kind of dumb. Oh, oh, that's a very bad placement. I need to, I need to counterbalance that a little bit. Oh my gosh, hold on. Let me stack three of these. No bread. This is like Nitty is about. Yeah, most likely, actually. Like, most likely. Worst part is that that method works, and while I was liking other profiles, I got 100 likes on my pics, which is crazy. Yeah! It's very weird. It's like the, mo the more you engage, the more engagement you get as well, which. Hmm. I'm a bot that wants all pups to get their forever home. Yes. I actually showed uh, the pictures of the pup you have right now, Nitty. I actually showed it to my co-worker. She was like, oh my god, what a cutie patootie. I want to take her home. And I was like, she's in Poland. And uh, my co-worker was like, well, I guess I can't take her home. <laughs> so, uh, so there's that. Puppy is definitely very cute. Such honorable. I, I, I don't know how you do it, Nitty, honestly. Like, I... Like, you should be proud of yourself that you're actually capable of doing that. Because, like, me me and Bruno, we've discussed um, fostering animals as well. And then we realized that both of us are not strong enough to do that. Because we would just end up adopting every single animal that came through our doors. Because... And we would go broke. So... Like, I already want to adopt every single animal that, like, I see on the streets. So, like, I really can't afford having them in my house and then... I'd just be depressed, honestly, that they're leaving. Because I'd want to keep all of them. So, Symbio, hello! Welcome on in. That's a weird-looking Taurus you're hunting. Oh, I'm not hunting Taurus right now. We, we have Centred and Furred over here, and that definitely takes priority, so... Tauros will come later. <laughs> How we doing, Symbio? So cute, though. They are so stinking cute. Oh, there's still a doggo over here. But, uh, but yeah, they're just cute. Did it come? They did some adoptions out of country. <laughs> yeah, I don't think, I don't think that would be, a an option here. Monetary-wise. I'm not ready for my own pup, so I think about relationship with my fosters, like, um, their weird aunt, their parents leave them, and they can't stand the kid. Oh my gosh, Coop's mad you're not hunting Tauros. I can imagine, but uh, like I said, there's there's Sentient and Furret over here, and uh, I I have always said that that's gonna be like the first thing we shiny hunt for in this game, so uh, I have to hold myself true to my agreement with myself. So we're gonna shiny hunt the Furrets and the to the the Sentient and the Furrets, and then once we're done with that, we'll figure out what's next. But first. We must get the shine. That's just such a big poo-poo hat. No, I'm not. I've made an agreement with myself. The moment I saw the trailer had fur it and center it, I was like, nope, that's gonna be the first thing. I like, I'll pause any shiny hunt to hunt this thing. So we're holding true to that. What about the transaction you made? He paid in points. We the man a refund. Oh no, that, that will do. As soon as we have this, that will be the next one. We'll continue with the Taurus. Don't you worry. Actually, just so you know, I'm not even changing this. Because if I change this, I change the Taurus count. I just hope this doesn't take long. <laughs> I want to get this fast, so we can go fast. He'll sue. <laughs> Don't you worry. We're gonna get back to the Taurus. I just need to get this first. We need to get a Centred and a Furs first. Hey, 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 
it. Look, 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 look. We got one already. Ah! We got one already. Okay. I think we have to luxury ball this. Yeah, I think we're gonna luxury ball this one, and then the other one we will use the premier ball for, I think. Yeah, that sounds like a good plan. That way we'll have matching Pokeballs. Sort of. Yeah, that's what we're gonna do. What is your luck? Uh, my luck is Symbio is over here forcing me to get back to the Tauros hunt, so that is forcing the luck to show up. Justice for Symbio, dude, no. We're gonna get there. Trust, trust, we're gonna get there. I just need to get one more Sentret, so we can evolve it into a Furret. That's all. That is all. That ain't so bad now, is it? We're just gonna run out this sandwich with the normal types. Hope we find another Sentret. And then get back to the Water Tauros. Actually, does the Water Tauros spawn on this map as well? Doubt? Oh gosh, no, don't worry. We're gonna run out the sandwich, or or we're gonna run out the sandwich, and then we're gonna have to make a new one, because I, I need to get two Sentrit. That's, that's my goal for today. My goal for today is getting a Sentrit, and then getting another Sentrit so I can evolve it into a Furret. That's the goal. Coop says should say purge the fairies. But these are not fairy types! Coop, what do you want about? These are nor these are normal types. How? <laughs> He wants him to hate the furret or hate the fairies. Ah, uh, no, don't hate the furret. The furret is perfect just as it is. Furret is very squishable. And I would like a life-size plush of, plush of it, but... I don't know how I would ever buy it or fit it in my luggage, so... That's not gonna happen anytime soon, sadly enough. <laughs> oh my gosh. Is this gonna be a thing now? Or is it gonna be a thing until I finish the shiny hunt for the water Tauros? Like, I don't even like the water Tauros. Yep, it's a thing now. Great, I love that for me. Oh my goodness, so great. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, I don't know if you guys are the best or the worst or both. Probably both. Both might be good. <laughs> oh my goodness. Hydrate? Yes, I will. We're here for the funny content. Oh my goodness. I uh, I don't know how funny the content will be today, but uh, apparently you guys are making it so. Actually, what is this? Nah. There's so many of you. Also, Sinka Tink is going to her forever home. Tomorrow. Wait, do you have a, th a Tinkatong that you're gonna transfer out? What? You're gonna transfer it into. Oh, the pup. Wait, you named the pup. I'm sorry, because you put Tink, Tink in like the, the, the brackets. I thought you meant that like you named the Tinkaton Sinka. 
Oh, think is the translation of. I'm sorry, I'm dumb. <laughs> I'm just dumb at this point. But yay, forever home for the doggo! Can I do flybys? Good thing it's weekend. Oh my gosh. And yesterday was a holiday, so today really felt like the entire week was crammed into one singular day. It was great. People were saying, like, have a good weekend, and we were just, me and my coworker were like, why are you saying have a good weekend? It's Monday. But then by the end, by the end of the day, we were both like, have a good weekend because we realized it's Friday. So we went from Monday to Friday in like a single day and it was great. Um, but yeah, uh, I already know what my next foster looks like. The pup has had recovery. Oh my God, that's so cool. I almost, I almost adopted a white cat with heterochromia instead of Oliver and Jasmine. Uh, that's what, this was before I knew of the existence of Oliver and Jasmine. Um, and, uh, I just didn't get the cat because they were making an issue about my balcony. And because I live on the eighth floor. And I was just like, dude, chill. Like, it's, it's partially closed off, not entirely closed off. They have, like, safe spaces to go to the balcony. And then they just didn't want want to let, let me adopt a cat because not the entirety of the balcony was closed off, which, like, just absolute stupidity at this point. But, but yeah, so essentially they, um... They didn't let me adopt the cat because they didn't agree with the fact that not my entire balcony was closed off, which is just absolutely dumb. But I got Jasmine and Oliver instead, so that's cool. Uh, I would love to see the view from your balcony. I have a great view from my balcony, dude. I, like, part of the reason we got this apartment instead of the first floor, which has, like, a large, like, uh, terrace space, is because of the freaking view. It's great. Also, road? Oh, I know, that's Nitty writing, so that, that would be not the color red in Dutch. Uh, Cien, welcome on in! You're on the leaderboard! CN's on the board! <laughs> Can't hear anything, I'm at work, but I will try watching. There. <laughs> Can't hear anything, but try watching. I do hand gestures. <laughs> that should be significant enough, right? <laughs> Wait, they stand on their tails? <gasps> That's so cute! Uh, my road is rude. Ah. Ah. Your color red is rude. I mean, it matches. Red can be rude. <laughs> so I've left. A lot. Enough. And my color red is... Shervoni? I wonder if Tasha can read l leet? Let? Late? Speak? What? What's that word? How do you read that word? I don't even know how to read that word. Sh. Shervoni. Shervoni? I'm gonna need some clarification on which language we're talking about over here, Savage. One three three seven is the word. Okay, but now what does it mean? <laughs> like it's it's fine. Everything's fine, but like what does it mean?
I don't think I've ever seen that word before. Like, for real, I have no clue what that is or what that's supposed to mean. Lead, let. Oh, like elite. So this will be lead. Wait, is that where lit comes from? Elite, lead, lit? Because that could make sense for an origin of the word. Lit comes from... I know, I know, but like it could also be like elite. Lit, lit, lit. Like, it, it, it makes sense. It can make sense at least. Do we have spawns down here? Oh no, those are hoots. Okay, we don't we don't want to hunt for the hoots right now. Well, even though we found one last stream, we don't need to hunt for the hoots right now. Yeah. The history of words is not a history that I've uh, studied thoroughly, I must say. There's like other history. Or just like TV shows and movies in general. <laughs> if I watch it once, I know it. And Bruno was really surprised. Actually, Bruno was really surprised about that yesterday because we were watching Ahsoka. Uh, yesterday evening, Savage knows, we texted. <laughs> uh, but we were watching Ahsoka uh, uh, in the evening and uh, I commented something and Bruno just pulled up a video from Rebels. And like this, like five seconds into the video, he was like, do you remember this? And I'm like, yep. Do you remember all of it? I'm like, yep. You show me five seconds. I've seen this before. So it's enough for me to know exactly what went on. Uh, which is why I don't usually watch things twice. At least not if, like, a lot of time has passed by, but, yeah. Or Disney movies. Like, Disney movies we can watch more th multiple times in, like, along the years. That and, um, Princess Iris. I do not get sick of that movie either. I can basically quote that movie at this point. So, uh, Sam, hello, welcome on in! I wish I could remember shows and movies the first time around. That's something I'm bad at. Normally it takes me three or four times before I can remember it. Dang, dude! Hello, uh, Savage! I would, uh, Savage. Sam, I would like to, uh, inform you that, uh, you've been kicked off the leaderboard by Cien. Uh, you are no longer in fifth place. Good sir. I am fully aware that you might have not been aware that you were competing with CN for fifth place, but uh, CN came in and swooped your spot. <laughs> Gives me motivation to get back to it. <laughs> you got a lot to go, sir. Squirtle, my boy. Squirtle is my original starter. Freaking love Squirtle. But yeah. But yeah, so that was kind of funny. That was kind of a funny situation that, that ensued after we finished watching Ahsoka um, yesterday, which was, which was fun. It's always funny to see like when Bruno gets surprised when I remember something about something I've watched. But then, don't remember something I said, like, maybe five minutes ago. <laughs> That's, uh... Funny. It's terrible. But it's funny. Got a nice ice-cold cider tonight for drinking and treating the burn I got from catching my arm and the... Are you putting the cider on the burn? Because I don't see how that otherwise will treat your burn, Sam. Yep, it's ice cold. Okay. <laughs> like, I don't I don't see how a burn can get treated with drinking cider. But, you know. 
You do you. <laughs> this is actually decent to- wait, can I zoom out even further? No. No, I cannot. I don't have aloe, so it's the next best thing. Uh, do you have ice? Or like frozen peas? Or like frozen corn? Just basically frozen vegetables. <laughs> Essentially. Had the cider bottles in the ice box, I have frozen peas too. Well, don't make direct contact with your skin. Put a layer in between. A t-shirt, a long sleeve, some cloth. Don't don't burn the burn. Don't ice burn the the hot burn. Does that make sense? Cause like you can technically I feel like you can technically burn a burn, cause like you burn something because you're hot. Because it was hot. But then if you put ice on it, you can still burn your skin even more, but due to the ice instead of due to the hot, so then you would be burning your burn. I feel like that's double painful. My workmate learned that the hard way this week. He burned himself and got frostburn from direct exposure to ice. Ew. That is, uh, that's not fun. Lurk, gotta go open. Put open on the side, ping me if you need me. Okay, Savage. Good luck on your secret spy mission. You go do your workies. <laughs> so, yeah. Speaking of workies, I have been putting in work watching uh, One Piece. And I am happy to report that we have reached the episode where they are entering the Grand Line. Um, and dang it, even the fillers are good. What the hell? We're on like episode 61 or something like that, or 62. Even the freaking fillers are good. Like, Bruno was like, oh, I want to skip this entire, like, millennial dragon, uh, part of, of, of this and just go straight into the grand line. But I'm just like, no, we want, we want to, we want to watch the fillers. The fillers are good. It's like a little side quest that they're doing. But like, good. Freaking one of those episodes almost made me cry, dude. I was emotional on the inside. <laughs> But also, today, in more anime news, um, <laughs> Spy X Family! Spy Family! Season 2 is coming out tomorrow! I am so excited for that! I haven't figured out what we're gonna do yet. I don't know if we're gonna... If we're gonna wait until the entire season is out and then binge watch it in one go, or if we're just gonna watch one episode per week in between all the One Piece episodes and... Loki. Ahsoka has ended and Loki is now starting, so... There's a lot of things to watch. This is so cool. And I, I'm i on holiday at the end of the month for two weeks. Like, the first two weeks of November. I'm off of work. I'm gonna watch so much stuff. I, I should probably do some work for, like, stream and stuff like that, too. But I'm gonna watch so much stuff. I'm gonna build so much stuff. I'm so excited to have two weeks off. Not going anywhere, but I'm still excited. I want to rebuild some cat shelves. Because I put some floating shelves up for them. That didn't go as planned. So I need to make it different so that they have the shelves. But it still looks pretty. And they can actually hold their weight. And that way it will camouflage the like five or six holes that we uh, poked in the wall that were not correct so that there's there's that too much time enough left 10 minutes oh no 
If I don't get another Sentret in the next 10 minutes, Symbio is gonna be extra, extra mad at me. Because I'm gonna have to make another sandwich, which is another 30 minutes of normal type shiny hunting, instead of shiny hunting for the Tauros. And we don't want Symbio to get mad, but I do really need a second, a second Sentret before I can keep going. Symbio, can you come back into chat? Because, like, last time you brought the shiny with you, so, like, maybe, maybe we can do that again? Oliver's still here. If that helps the, con the convincing part of it. He's not here at the moment! Oh, no! He, he gone! He brought the shiny luck, and then he left with the shiny luck. No good. <laughs> I wouldn't recommend asking me for shiny luck. I had a level one shiny detective Pikachu. Dude, how did that happen? I saw your story actually, Sam. How did you... How did... Like, what are the odds of a level one Pokemon fleeing? Did you golden ultra ball it too? Cause like that just, that just sounds nearly impossible. If you if you golden raspberry ultra balled it and it's a level one, that sounds nearly impossible to happen. I still don't know how the odds of a level 1 shiny fleeing is extremely low, something like 1 in 10,000 odds. I even excellent curveballed it. Okay, but did you ultra ball golden raspberry though? That is the question. Yes, you did. Damn, dude. That's just incredibly bad luck. Like, incredibly bad luck. But did you- did you manage to- to get another? You managed to get another shiny Detective Pikachu, right? You found a second one? Yeah, I hit some crazy odds in the worst possible way. I was so shocked I started laughing. <laughs> I can imagine, I can imagine. I caught one prior to that, luckily. Oh, that's good, at least. But, like, sadly, you, you missed the level 1 one? Because that way you could have evolved the, the other one that you had caught into the Detective Raichu. I got lucky, too. I managed to get a Shiny Detective Pikachu from Research. Which I don't actually know if that's better odds or worst odds, but, like, it's odds. It's some odds. Um... And you usually don't get shinies from research, so that was kind of nice. IVs terrible though. For for a shiny that's coming from research, the IVs are absolutely like bottom of the barrel. So yeah, that's what I hoped for because they are massively boosted currently. Oh nice, I think it's the same boosted odds. Yeah, I don't know. I have one Detective Pikachu from research to check still. I have not checked that one yet. Um, so kind of hoping. To maybe get double lucky. Because, like, they're not really spawning a lot. Like, I'm getting a lot of Slowpoke, but I'm not getting a lot of, uh... A lot of Pikachu spawns. Not 100% sure why that is the case, but that is the case. Drop rate for Pikachu is quite low. Yeah. It is what it is, I guess. Centret, centret, centret. We got six minutes for centret. I actually do not remember if I saved the game before, so I'm just gonna save just to be safe. Once a day to- Oh, I haven't done my photobomb for today! Thank you for reminding me, Sam. Hold on, give me a second. Actually, no, I'll do that after the sandwich. I have time after the sandwich. Otherwise, I'm gonna forget the photobomb. 
That's one less opportunity to get it. This is what you get when you're playing in like three different Pokemon games at the same time. Cause like, I'm doing Pokemon Sleep, I'm doing this game, I'm doing Pokemon Go. Actually, make it four cause like I'm creating Hatchimon as well. <laughs> this is what I get from doing four different Pokemon games at once. And yes, I am aware of how insane that sounds. And I'm fully okay with it. Hans, thanks for the shiny luck! Sandwich is almost over, I really hope I get it because we need to get back to the Taurus before Symbio causes a riot. <laughs> I'm still yet to find a shiny and sleep. Yeah, I actually made a, what I consider to be a mistake. Um, so yesterday I had the day off. And I, uh, I accidentally ended the sleep session before I was done sleeping. Because I forgot to, ter to turn off the alarm. Uh, but then I, I, sleepily, I activated the sleep session again. And uh, that counted for today's sleep session. For some reason. Well, not for some reason, for all the reasons. Um, <laughs> so, uh, so let's see how today will go, because I have no freaking clue how tonight's gonna go, or what's gonna count, or what's not gonna count. Fact is, when I woke up this morning, I did not have my bonus biscuit. So, I don't know. Shinies are the sleep you got along the way. I mean, hey, if you had good dreams, why not? My rage shall not be contained. Symbio! You better pray that in the next four minutes I get another shiny centret, otherwise I'm gonna make another sandwich. For the normal type. Which means another 30 minutes. <laughs> of shiny hunting centret instead of the Tauros. I would have eight hours, uh, but server crashed and I only had 655 recorded. Eight hours 40. Oh. Yeah, that's not very fun. Oh gosh. I actually had a pretty turbulent night's sleep today. I don't know, it was hot, but then cold, then it was hot again, just nothing really made a lot of sense, so to say. I think about replaying Pokemon Rumble with the Rumble Weekend mod to do some shiny hunting. I don't think I've, I don't think I remember ever playing Rumble, to be honest. At least not as far as I remember. It isn't when I'm trying to attempt to reach master, yeah. I, uh, I'm actually getting really close to hitting master one in, uh, Cyan Beach. But, uh... Well... The double sleep did not help with that. At least I don't think so. Wait, where are my spawns? My sandwich is not over. I have two minutes left, so where are my spawns? Uh, I'm almost ultra four for green. I am currently ultra f I'm halfway through ultra four for Cyan Beach at this moment. Uh, last week I hit master two on Cyan Beach, which was just absolutely amazing, but it's probably also because I had the, like, good sleep ticket on for Monday still. So. Wolf King Mike, hello! Thanks for the shiny luck! Welcome on in! Uh, my choice, Cyan Beach. Yeah, just, just make sure you have the right Pokemon for Cyan Beach. Because otherwise, you're gonna have a tough time. <gasps> oh! Oh, we did it! We did it! We did it! Wolf King Mike brought the shiny luck! We are not needing to make a second.
second sandwich for Centret! Let's go! This needs to go into a premiere ball, so I can evolve into the ferret. Why does the silver slug hate me so? Wolfgang, I am I am sending the shiny lug back to you so you can get your, your silver slug. Oh, I'm so happy right now. <laughs> we can get the ferret! And we can get it to walk. And Oliver is now grooming again. Hello, sir, are you grooming again? Let's go! Okay, now I have to evolve it. Which means we're gonna put it in the party. I don't know what that was. How much time do I have left on the sandwich? We have a minute left on the sandwich. This is amazing. Now, where is it? Okay, first of all, I'm not... These two need to move because we're not... Those are not gonna get given away. Okay. So we're gonna evolve this one and we're gonna put it in place of Ogre Pond. Now Ogre Pond isn't shiny, so Ogre Pond can move elsewhere. Where do I have space? I have space over here. What did I just do? Oh. Whoopsies! There, you can go there. Anyway. Okay. Save. Okay, so now we just essentially need to kill a bunch of Pokemon. We're gonna put Bombi in first. And just let it go ham. Maybe I should do actual battles. Is there a trainer nearby that I can fight? There must be, right? I haven't fought any trainers in this, uh... In this place. Oh, there's one over there. Let's go. Let's fight this dude. Let's get some XP. So we can evolve. Oh, Oliver, Oliver moved around. Okay, hold on. That way his cute little head is still visible. Hello, sir. Also, I need to take the photobomb. This is getting hectic right now. I need to take the photobomb and Pokemon Go before I forget. <laughs> the battle music still slaps, actually. <laughs> oh, we're back to another grooming lesson with Oliver. Uh, I just need any Pokemon that I can take a picture of at this point. Hold on. <laughs> We're doing everything at once. This is perfectly fine. Okay, now I do want to keep the photobombs. So I can potentially use them in edits later. So let's just... I'm just gonna put it against the wall. All right, we got the Pikachu photobomb. Look, it's actually really cute. Hold on, look. Watch this be shiny. That would be amazing. I highly doubt it though. It is not shiny. It is not shiny. Oh, Abu, yeah, oh well. It is what it is. Oh wait, there's now a slowpoke here as well. Hold on. Shiny slowpoke? Shiny slowpoke? No, no shiny slowpoke. I forgot to tell you. Yes. What's up, Hans? I went out today biking and playing Pogo and I got both the event Pikachu and the slowpoke shiny. Dude, that's amazing. I found one singular shiny this event, which was the research Pikachu. I got one shiny from the research, that was it. 
That was it. I highly doubt I'll get lucky again. So. Actually, I should put Sentry out front. I think I am take our announcement to announce Shiny Phantom. That's one shiny I want badly. Are they announcing that they're gonna announce Shiny Phantom? Is that what you mean? Doesn't that defeat the purpose of the announcement though? Like if you're gonna announce that you're gonna announce something. Oh, that's what you meant. Actually, the sandwich is technically over. Uh, which means I could just evolve the ferret back in Paldea. And we can continue shiny hunting for the Taurus there. I guess. I guess we have to do that, huh? Symbia, why you gotta make me miserable? Uh, where was it that I was shiny hunting for it? It was over here. Oh, actually, we can just check the auction as well. Uh, since it didn't have the shiny icon originally on the October update, it'll be like when Tyrant and Amoda shinies got revealed once Adventure League was announced. Yeah, I can see that happening. Especially considering that Pumpkaboo is already available as a shiny, right? Pumpkaboo is already available as a shiny, right? That is a question. I thought it was, but kind of unsure at this point. Uh, dive Ball, Sunstone, Grappa Berries. That's not. Yep, and Phantom has been heavily. Yeah, like Phantom is also the uh, spotlight out. The spotlight hour. The what you calls it? The, um, uh, b b the the showcase. Phantom is also the showcase for that week. So, that is also, I guess, something to take into consideration. Uh, okay, so this is not the area where they spawn. Okay, here we go again. Yeah, I can't have Sentred out front for this, actually. Uh, Miascarada out front. Oh, dang it. Shroomies is next week, and then the week after it's Pumpkaboo, then Phantom right after. Yeah. It would be cool if Pumpkaboo uh, spawned a lot, actually. I, I, I think that would be very nice. But I don't think that's gonna happen. In spotlight hour, not bad. No, 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 the showcase, the showcase. It's gonna be a showcase. As well, I think. Maybe I read that wrong, it's actually the spotlight hour. Did my game just, oh. Thank, thank goodness, it was middle of saving. Ah, oh, dang it. Okay, now Pumpkaboo will be the showcase. I need a shiny... Oh, this is originally. Yeah, I don't... I don't have the shiny Pumpkaboo either. I would like to have it though. Okay, we're gonna heal up. Okay, I need to put my Tauros uh, thing back on again, which is that, and that is gonna give me the distinction of what it is that we're looking for over here. 
Because otherwise, we don't freaking know. Symbio, I hope you're happy. We're going back to the Tauros hunt. I'm not happy about that. I got a shiny liquid after you got the Sentry. Yes! Mike, that's amazing! Shiny Litwick is great. Shiny Litwick is actually great. Alrighty, so it's not like I can make a sandwich within the Pokemon Center, right? Do I have any... Great ends over here? No, I do not. Okay, well, I guess... Can I make a picnic here? <laughs> uh, wait, wait, wait. Maybe I can. No! I can't. Dang it. Actually, do I have enough ingredients for a, for a water sandwich? What's the water sandwich? It's cucumbers. Oh no, I need to go shopping before I can do this. Oh my goodness. Where do I get cucumbers in this place? I only have one left and I need at least four for a sandwich. Oh, I landed inside. That's great. Okay, let's see what we need. Cucumbers. We will buy many. We will buy 50. We will pay cash. Oh my goodness. Okay. Yeah. I went shopping today in game and I have to go shopping tomorrow in real life and that really sucks. I was supposed to have gone grocery shopping yesterday because I had a I had a day off anyways, but then anime happened. And I didn't go. Because you know, anime. Anime sometimes just happens. I did grocery shopping earlier. It's so much nicer at night when there's no people or scaring kids around. Yeah, basically um, tomorrow I'm gonna have to go grocery shopping alone uh, because Bruno uh, is going to be working. Um, but I have to basically, because of like all the stuff that we need to carry, like I can carry things with the cart, but like then to carry everything from the car into the house is a whole other story. <laughs> or actually multiple stories. Um, so I have to basically time me going out for grocery shopping, uh, and how much time I usually take to do grocery shopping if I'm alone, with, uh, essentially the time that Bruno is done with work. So if I basically need to go do grocery shopping in a way where I'm done by 6pm so that he can then get home more or less at the same time as me, we can carry everything to the house and then go do the rest of the things that we need to do um, later that day. So, yeah, it's it's gonna be interesting. <laughs> it's gonna be interesting. See if I can time things correctly. I have no uh, I have no raid dens over here that I can like stand on. So that's kind of sad, actually. Okay. Well, we definitely need the Sentra to evolve because I need to see the ferret walk before I end stream. So that's definitely something that needs to get done. No, I can't mix two sweets or one sweet and one. Okay. We know what to do. Next. We're gonna do one sour and one spice. And we're gonna use the blue flag. I need to buy more flags, actually. That should be a good idea. That should be a good idea. 
Okay, let's pile on these cucumbers. Also, are you guys enjoying seeing Oliver sleeping over there? Cause like, dude's very, very cute. I hope you guys are enjoying the extra host tonight. Finally got the slugma, yes! Damn, Mike, your uh, shiny look is like on point today. That that was not long since you said you got the, um, the Litwick. Uh oh. <gasps> Will it still work? Okay, we're just gonna have to find out. We're just gonna have to find out. Otherwise, I'm gonna have to reset, which is okay, because we did go to the Pokemon Center. And we also did go to Medali, so it saved in the meantime. I hope. Otherwise, we have to go shopping again. I know it definitely saves at the Pokemon Center, because that's definitely a save point. Um, it's just a matter of if it's saved before or after. Uh, no, no, you don't know how long it took to get a single shiny Slugma. I spent several hours on this mountain. Dang, are you making the right sandwiches, though? Sparkling power water, tidal power water, teensy power water. Ah, we're gonna have to reset. Dang it. That is not the right sandwich. I need encounter power and sparkling power. The other one I don't really care about, but I need encounter and sparkling because otherwise we're never gonna get this done. Uh, but yeah, Mike, I understand the feeling. Like it took me finding 12 Litleo to finally get the male Litleo, which took like 12 sandwiches coincidentally. So, so yeah. Fire level three, no, water level three. And he's sparkling an encounter and then whatever the other one is. Oh, for Slugma, sorry. Thought you were safe for this. Wait, am I healing my Pokemon again? Does this mean that I don't have ingredients right now? I get the feeling that, yeah, I get the feeling that this is the last place it's saved. Yeah, okay, we need to go shopping again. Just to be sure none of these are shiny. That would have been way too lucky if that was the case. Like way, way, way too lucky. Alrighty. We're back in the market. I need to remember to say before I make the sandwich. If you want a way easier recipe, just do one cucumber, one salty herb, one spicy herb. Wait, like for real? Does that, does that give a uh, sparkling power and uh, encounter power as well? Cucumbers for anything, anyways. If that gives both the sparkling power and the encounter power, I don't really care what the third one is. But if it gives at least those two, I think it cancels most other type spawns too. Huh. Now that's some interesting information. We can definitely try that. Let's just stand in the middle of the road. I'm gonna save before I make the sandwich. That way if I have to reset, I won't be fully... You know? Damn that... 
Look at him. He's so. Wait. He's just so fucking cute. Look at this dude. Just the absolute cutest patootiest of all the cutie patootiest. Anyway. He decides to be my co-host today and steal my chair, so I guess I'm not getting my chair back for this stream. That's fine. That's okay. This entrance is gonna turn into a ferret. Sooner or later. Okay, so one cucumber, one salty, one spicy. Let's try. One cucumber. One salty, one spicy. I don't have a lot of salties though. Let's see what happens here. Okay, so we are getting... Drum roll, please. Well, this is getting eaten. Let's get it. Look at this belly! Oh my gosh! He's giving out fan service over here. Sparkling power water, shadow powder water, and counter power water. Okay! I don't know what tidal power does, but it's got sparkling and it's got encounter and it's all level three. This is a good idea. I use way less ingredients and the same amount of Herba Mystica. That's actually great. Thanks for the tip, Hans. Wait, do you have a chart for this other recipe? Because like the recipe I'm using uses cucumbers and pickles. And then three ingredients of whatever else is there. Title means mark, I believe. Okay. Oh boy, there's a lot of them here. If I just move left and right, it can't hit me, right? I do. Do you think you can send it on the Discord, uh, hun? If you if you have if you have like a chart or like a graphic or something like that. That would be kind of amazing. Oh, crap. It hit me. So that one is not shiny. Actually. Neither is that one. And that one... That one isn't it either. Alright, so none of these are shiny. That's, that's good, that's good, that's good, that's good. Is that good? No, it's actually bad, but you know, it's fine. Should think, I made this recipe list when the game first came out. Oh, you made this recipe list. Oh, wow. That's very cool, dude. Be in the Pokemon chat. Thank you. Because that, that recipe list of yours uses a lot less than, uh, a lot less ingredients than the other one, which does mean that the sandwiches are easier to make, which I do definitely appreciate. Less, you know, pyramidy towers worth of ingredients. I cannot distinguish if there are any shinies in there. I highly doubt there is. That looks kind of shiny, but at the same time, it kind of doesn't. 
Actually, I need to change the number to six as well on this. Oh, that, that one hit me. Uh, this is six bread. This is the sixth bread. It's great. It's just... How many sandwiches do you reckon this is going to take before I get the sand? Before I get this shiny? I sleep? Okay, Nitty, have a good rest. Sleep tight. Don't let the bed bugs bite. Take care of your pupper for adoption day. Bye. Oliver says bye too with his sleepy little belly. He's a floof. Actually, I kind of want to pull him closer. Such a good baby. Such a good baby. Okay. <laughs> Look at the yawns. He's the actual star of today. That's uh that's truly it. He's the actual star of the day. What did I hit? Oh, uh, I hit. I had a little skidoo. I don't think any of the. Oh, no, it's starting again. Can I at least look at you and, like. I don't think these look shiny. I think I can just flee from all of them. I swear, after this freaking shiny hunt, I'm just gonna need new glasses. That's, that's basically what I'm concluding over here. Can they hit me if I'm on this rock? Oh, we got in range of the Miascarada, let's go! Go do some damage, Miascarada, go do some damage. What do you guys reckon I'm gonna get first? The shiny regular like fighting Taurus or am I gonna get the, the water Taurus first? Cause... At this point I don't even know. At this point I don't even know if I'd be happier with the water one or not. Oh, is it too far away? Dang, it's too far away, isn't it? I will stay on my rock where it's a little bit safer. I am hoping. I don't think that one's shiny. Can this still hit me if I'm on the rock? I don't think it can, right? Did we try this out before? I think I'm okay if I'm on this rock. At least for a little bit. Does that one look darker? 
Maybe not. I mean, Meow Scott is doing some work over there. And that's perfectly fine. Oh, they just keep spawning over there and I'm not even moving. Don't think that one's shiny. Do those two look the same color? I think they do. Yeah, they definitely do. Oh my gosh. Well, as long as Meowscarada's over there doing work. Oh, never mind. Stop doing work! Do some work. Over there. No! This is gonna be annoying to get out of. Do any of you look like you have faces that are darker than other faces? You guys reckon this entire group looks the same? I just... And I think they do. This one didn't have the sparkles. I don't... I don't... I don't even know... What to do anymore, honestly. Why am I shiny hunting this again? Oh no. This is great. I love this for me. I just like kindly just stay on this ledge. You reckon that'd be okay? Cause I'm just gonna slip and fall. Or kinda keep running, I guess. don't actually have a rock to stand on over here, which is not so fine. Oh yeah, 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 The further back they stand, the more shiny they look, even if they're not entirely shiny, which is kind of incredibly annoying. Stand on this rock. Please and thank you. Do all of those look the same color? I guess that's a yes. Oh, Oliver's turned around. Oh, this one hit me! This was not the deal. The rock was supposed to be safe. figure out how much time I have after the sandwich because this is a I don't like this 18 minutes Ugh. 18 minutes that's I love that for me 
Guys, I'm gonna be honest with y'all. I think I'm gonna end stream after this sandwich is over. Um, yeah, I think that's gonna be the plan. But I'm actually kind of tired. And, uh... Well, clearly Oliver is bored already as well, so... Are you shiny? No. This is gonna take forever. Okay, okay, this is it. This is it. Centred is evolving. We're gonna get my foot! I need to see it walk, which is not a great place. Oh my god, it's so pretty! Jaros, ah! get away from here! Look at it! Oh my gosh! He's so cute! This could have actually used a love ball and it would have matched perfectly as well, but I only have one and I decided to, to use it on the blob, but the premiere ball is very nice for it too. Oh, I'm so happy with this thing. Yay! Can I like get somewhere safe? Like safe adjacent? I caught mine in a dream ball. I, uh... I wanted more of the special Pokeballs, but, you know. Can't have everything, sadly enough. Okay, here's the deal, though. I don't want to sacrifice 15 minutes of this sandwich because I want to see the Furret walk. Actually, I am going to sacrifice a few minutes of the sandwich because I want to see the fur walk. No! No, 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 This is not, this is not it. I just want to see it walk. So long though. Dang. Look at the noodle! Okay. That's enough because there's like an entire horde of Tauros over here. That is not, not that's not a fun place to be at. Having to deal with an entire horde of Tauros. Okay, I am very, very satisfied with how noodly the fur it is. Dude, be very noodly. That is very nice. No, I need to become a master at avoiding Tauros. 
Unless the shiny wants to hit me, then that's fine too. If that's not the case... <sighs> oh my gosh. I need to be saved from the shiny hunt. I need to be saved from the shiny hunt. Is there a better way to get the water Tauros to spawn as a, to, to spawn? To spawn as a shine? To spawn as a shiny? Like there's gotta be there's, there's there's gotta be an easier way, a better way, a nicer way, a place where I don't get hit by all the Tauros. There's no repels in this game, which is kinda sucky. This is like the moment where I kinda wished that repels were a thing in this game. That would have been kind of nice. Aren't you fighting? Fight! Because we gotta keep moving. We gotta keep moving. Because we gotta keep moving, moving, moving. We gotta keep moving. Oh no. I don't want to hit, be hit by a bull Unless it's shiny, I'm a fool Cause I don't want to be hit I don't- I don't actually know what I'm doing anymore, guys The shiny hunt is gnawing at my final brain cell and uh, I don't necessarily appreciate that So At this point, if I can get at least one shiny, doesn't even matter if it's not the water Tauros. If it's a Tauros, it, I'll be I'll be happy enough to at least know that they exist. Hiding behind the signs. I wonder if they can see me from here. Oh, they can. Yes, they can. doing so good. Why did I stop? gonna be a problem, isn't it? To do this anymore. Can I quit? <laughs> Can I shiny hunt for this offline? Try to find the shiny offline while I watch anime or something? That that that, that would be kind of nice. Might not entirely lose my mind that way.
Yeah, I'm definitely ending stream after this. I'm very happy with my two shinies for today. And, uh... I need to find a new strategy to not completely destroy my brain trying to figure out these shinies. Guys, this is actual torture. And Symbio isn't even here to see it. And if he is, he's awfully quiet and I don't appreciate it. look shiny and not shiny at the same time who who decided this was a good idea to make this shiny this unnoticeable who gave permission for this torture device I actually understand what's going on half of the time. This is great. This is fine. I feel like the word's burning around me, but this is fine. You know what the worst part is? Even if I encounter... Even if I encounter something that isn't a shiny, I can't tell if what's around it is or isn't a shiny because they all just look like they are and aren't at the same time. into that then I Is they all look shiny and not shiny at and like how just why why is this the thing
I don't think any of this looks right. I'm gonna check the Pokedex, just to be safe that I didn't miss a shiny by accident. This sign gives a little bit of a coverage. Because, like, they can run into the sign without running into me. It's clearly nice. Oh. See, I shouldn't have started talking. The moment I started talking is when things start to go wrong. I should, I should just stay quiet. Slash so that's great. That is actually great. Mm. If I go check the Pokedex and it says that I missed a shiny, I think I'm gonna freak out. On the other hand, I do want to be sure that I didn't miss a shiny. <laughs> the same to me but they also both look different to me no they look the same again I'm gonna need new glasses after all of this that's for sure and these are new doesn't make it any better Got 10 seconds left. Well then, never mind! I keep bumping into things. any of these are it. This is also the last batch of Tauros that we're getting. Ok, 
Okay, that wasn't it either. Okay. Simp, hello! Welcome on in! I, uh... I have a headache. These Toros are not fun. I'm not enjoying this. Why am I hunting for this again? Alright, Symbio asked for it. Reaffirming to myself that I am an idiot, essentially. Oh, I found a Ditto instead. That, that's, that's lovely. Oh, wait, there's more Toros. Oh, none of those are the water ones. That's fine. I'm over here losing my brain cells, and then Oliver's over there just sleeping. Being all cute. I just need to wait for, like, a Tauros outbreak and just hope for the best at this point. I don't think there's any way we're gonna get the shiny Tauros without an outbreak. That sucks. That actually sucks. Never seen a cat enjoy belly rubs this much. It's kind of amazing. How do you like this so much? How? He is very loved, trust me. <laughs> Okay, so first thing we're gonna do is we're just gonna fly to somewhere where Taurus doesn't spawn because I'm sick and tired of getting hit by that. And I wanna, I wanna see the tippy tappies again. I tried to get ribbon for my shiny Tion I got. <gasps> Look at it! Wait, which game are you playing, Simp? Hello? <gasps> oh my god, no way! This is way too stinking cute! <gasps> it does the smiley, smiley thing. Oh my god, it walks! It tippy tappies! It tippy tappies! I cannot. How is this so freaking cute? Can I put my camera out? <gasps> uh... Beautiful. Where am I? Where's the ferret? Oh my god, is it at my feet? Oh! <gasps> Freaking goodness, are you freaking kidding me right now? This is the cutest thing ever. How is this so freaking cute? Look at this face! It's beautiful. This was definitely worth <laughs> This was absolutely worth it. It is so stinking cute. <gasps> it woke up. Hi. Could you look over here? Wait, where'd you go? Where'd you go? 
Oh, it's running. I'm pointing towards the wall. Oh no, it disappeared. Okay, never mind. I'm done with the pictures. It did. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. Okay, I'm gonna stop fangirling about this freaking ferret because holy crap, it is adorable. Look at him. He's almost my height. This is amazing. Come on. Beautiful. I had to take a screenshot of that one. It's just tippy tappies. <laughs> okay. Enough fangirling for this, guys. Enough fangirling for this. I have no idea what I'm gonna do with this freaking Tauros. I feel like there should be a better way to get it, or an easier way to get it, than trying to fight it in this specific location. I don't, I don't freaking know. I, I really, really don't. Apparently, it only spawns one water, one per group of five Tauros, which is terrible. There's no repels in this game. There has to be a better way to shiny hunt for this thing. That doesn't involve eggs, because I'm not ready for eggs. Um, I don't know. <gasps> oh my goodness, it's so cute. It stretches. I can't. It's beautiful. Anyway. Uh, guys, I think I'm going to end stream here. Uh, I'm gonna put you guys on full screen. I'm gonna I'm gonna end stream here. I'm kind of tired. My head's kind of hurting as well. All the Taurus is not doing great. Um, got my Fiona sword shield, but I am in BD to get the daily ribbons. Okay. Well, you're doing good, dude. You're doing good, Simp. You can do this. I believe in you. I believe that you can get the ribbon. Today is your day. It's not my day for Taurus, but it's your day for the for the Fiona. <laughs> Uh, meanwhile, Oliver's over here, um, once again, giving you another tutorial on how to groom. <laughs> yeah, let me put you guys on, sh on uh, full screen. So, uh, so yeah, I am, once again, uh, chat is on me at this moment. Uh, Oliver is giving y'all the full tutorial on how to groom. This is, uh, lesson number three of the day. So, uh, I hope you guys appreciate Oliver's efforts into showing y'all how it is you know, important to bathe and groom and all that jazz. Um, he is very cute. He is very cute. <laughs> this is the actual star. This is what y'all came for to watch Oliver sleep. This is what y'all came for today. Guys, I'm actually kind of tired. My head's kind of hurting a little bit. Uh, so I'm going to end stream here. We got two shinies today. We got the centret. We got the other centret that we evolved into the ferret, which was the goal for today. We've accomplished that. And now we're going to have to waste a bunch of sandwiches trying to find a water Tauros because Simio decided on that. So once we get that, we can go full uh, full steam ahead with the shiny hunts. And uh, hopefully uh, Tauros will not take much longer because we're six sandwiches in and this this is just not fun anymore. <laughs> This is just torture at this point for my eyes, so Yeah, I'm gonna go Google on like what the best way to shiny hunt for water Tauros is and if it says eggs then I don't even know what I'm gonna do, but there just there has to be a better way, right? There has to be a better way. Anyways guys, I thank you all so much for being here today I will be back and maybe Oliver will be back too. Are you kidding me? Oliver, are you really? Sir? Sir? That is my chair. Don't scratch it, please. I was like, he's leaving at the end of stream? That's so unfair. <laughs> like, I had to get a second chair to do stream sitting down today. Otherwise I would have been on my knees or like sitting on the floor or something. Um, yeah. Anyways, Oliver says goodbye. And uh, I'll see you guys back on Monday, 8.30 p.m. my time, which is 9.30 for most of Europe. Should be 12.30 PST, like 6, 7.30 a.m. Australia, Sydney time, depending on time conversions and daylight savings and whatnot. Um, check out stream on Monday. Just figure out if Oliver is going to be hosting it again and I'm going to be your co-host again. Um, and yeah, I hope everyone has a fantastic weekend. 
all the shiny luck to everyone that is still shiny hunting, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Okay? Okay. Oliver says bye. He's the star here. Okay. Bye, guys. Oh. Yeah. Exactly, Oliver. You know what you're doing. <laughs> okay. Bye, guys.